What is a day like for a farm manager on a layer farm? Let's join him today to find out. He usually arrives at the farm around 6.30 in the morning, before employees begin their day at 7. He then makes rounds to check on everything, starting with the youngest flock and moving to the oldest. These birds are four weeks old, he checks if they have adequate water and feed. The feed should be consumed an hour before the next feeding. He also checks on the bird's overall health condition. This is done every day, including holidays. On to the next flock. High mortality suddenly occurred today, among these seven we pulled birds. He quickly diagnosed it and confirmed that it was gangrenous dermatitis, more commonly known as wing rot. For this case, he immediately ordered that these birds be treated with antibiotics. Moving on to these 17 weeks old birds. He noticed that the feeding trough was too empty, so he informed the caretaker of the new feed allocation, plus for grams per bird starting today. By walking through, he can check the ammonia level with his own nose. Today, it's fine. On these 30 week cold birds, he found several soft shelled eggs. And since Lamis was not present, he ruled out calcium and vitamin D deficiency. He thinks it could be a mild challenge with IV, infectious bronchitis. So, he ordered a full farm revaccination by a course spray and programmed it to be done every 30 days from now on. Around 8, he had a simple breakfast. Chocolate oatmeal and, of course, hard-boiled eggs. He then proceeds to clerical tasks, receiving orders from customers, encoding the previous day's production, and so on. Now it's 9 o'clock, and he checks in with the egg 42. We have a rodent issue that needs to be addressed. It is now 10 o'clock, and he supervised the loading for the afternoon's delivery. Afterwards, he continues to check on the rest of the farm. He always pays attention to the bird's droppings, dry droppings are a good sign. By 11 o'clock, he's done and calls it a day. Tomorrow, he'll start all over again. 